The number one is Marantz NR1510 Bluetooth. If you're new to the process of putting together a home theater system, the Marantz NR1510 Bluetooth comes with a digital setup assistant that provides you with a step-by-step -step tutorial for creating the optimal configuration. This product is available on Amazon for $431. This product has average 4.3 stars from more than 14 customer reviews. A customer said. High quality piece of equipment. Great sound with setup features that made the sound the best I've ever experienced with existing speaker system. Another happy customer said. Great receiver and love all the features. For a medium size home theater and 5.1 surround setup this receiver has plenty on power and love the way Odessi sets up everything nicely. The only issue I am having is with the EARC to my Sony X950 TV. I have consistent audio drops when watching native apps through the TV with EARC connected from TV to the Marantz. I have tried several different HDMI cables, changed settings, reboots, but can't seem to solve the issue. I am hardwired to both with 100 mg internet speed so it's not a. The second product in our list is. Yamaha RX V485BL. The Yamaha RX V485BL is designed to work with the company's Musicast wireless speakers, so you can establish a surround sound setup without having to run cables all around the room. It can be controlled with your voice through Alexa. This product is available on Amazon for $329. Check out the link in the YouTube description below. There are 232 customers have reviewed this product. The average rating is 4.3 stars. A customer said. Despite being quite familiar with AV equipment I had a bit of a difficult time setting up the functions correctly. The situation is somewhat aggravated by numerous decoders, source options, and hidden features, options in the various devices that work together but need to be set up separately. This receiver has an source info option that displays the number of incoming channels and signal info. This is how I found out my TV was only outputting two-channel audio and it took quite a bit of time to finally sort through the issue. Every TV is somewhat different, however, I wanted to alert. The next product in our list is Denon AVRS650H. The Denon AVRS650H offers a wide color gamut with 4, 4 to 4 subsampling, so those with high end TVs or projectors will experience a vibrant picture. It's available in 7.2 and 9.2 channel versions, in case you see yourself expanding your system in the future. The price approximately $349. There are 129 customers have reviewed this product, the average rating is 4.3 stars. A customer said. I have no idea why people were complaining about the 90s Nintendo style user interface, UI. Is that what makes a good receiver? I was actually happy to have a screen interface because I'm used to programming off the front receiver screens that show a total of 15 characters. The point of this is that I saw those reviews and thought they were dumb. But nonetheless, one day I got a notification for an update from Denon. After the update the UI was more modern and higher resolution. The company listened and delivered for the crybabies. For the actual receiver. The number 4. Yamaha RX V385. The Yamaha RX V385 features a clean 4K pass-through with HDCP 2.2 support so you'll get the most out of the audio and video signals you use in your home theater. Music lovers will appreciate its Bluetooth connectivity for easy streaming, as well. This product is available on Amazon for $279. There are 644 reviews which average rating is 4.5 stars for this product, a customer said. I've had a non-HDMI Yamaha 5.1 receiver for a long time now. More and more consoles are ditching optical for 5.1 like the Wii U and Switch, so it was time for an upgrade. Pros, you can use the on-screen display to set things up faster than the receiver's panel. I love this, supports linear PCM, so 5.1 on the Switch is great. 
tons of settings to configure like individual speaker volume levels. Old Rekivers probably had that, but they were buried within the front panel's menus. You can label inputs, as you'll see in my images. Everything just works. I didn't have to do. Another happy customer said, Absolutely love it. Bluetooth connectivity for playing music from a source device is great but playing my huge collection of high-quality MP3, etc. Files from a USB flash drive is absolutely a dream come true. The files artists, albums and songs, are all displayed on the TV screen for easy navigation. 5.1 channel movie watching is excellent as well. The Wipeow Auto Calibration for speaker setup is very nice. The next product in our list is Onkyo TX Senior 494 Avenue. With 160 watts per channel, the Onkyo TX State Route 494 AV is one of the most powerful options at its price point. It uses Dolby's innovative, height virtualizer, to create a realistic soundstage for TV shows, movies and music of all genres. The price is around $199. Check out the product link in the YouTube description below. This product is rated with 4.3 stars from 95 customer reviews. A customer said. The main reason we wanted this started out to be getting the ability to get surround sound decoding for primetime TV drama. Surround sound caused a great amount of dialogue is hard to understand when loud music or sound effects cover the speaking or other details, but also wanted inputs for DVD, etc. Nothing we found to decode 5.1 and gave us remote volume control. This Onkyo unit is superbly designed. Includes things like self-protection circuits in case a speaker line gets shorted. And finally, a use for the HDMI ARC function. With only two HDMI ports included on our Samsung N. The next product in our list is Sony STRDH590-52. The Sony STRDH 595.2 takes your standard surround sound layout and gives you the option of adding an extra subwoofer to provide a more rumbling, bass-heavy experience. Even without that second sub, though, it still performs very well. This product is available on Amazon for $178. Check out the link in the YouTube description below. This product has average 4.3 stars from more than 987 customer reviews. A customer said. Fantastic. I replaced an old, 2005 Sony 5.18V receiver that did not have enough HDMI ports nor an HDMI ARC compatible port to play my TV audio through the receiver without having to use an additional digital video cable. I also needed the 4K pass through this new receiver supports and what the hey, I also wanted to add another subwoofer to my surround system. The configuration menu displayed on my TV was pretty cool also and made it much easier to configure all my other equipment I have hooked up to the receiver. A great product at a great price. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below. So if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.